Okay, everybody. DK here, Mr. V Amps. Um, what's next for our channel? Because we usually fix things, but we haven't had much to fix. And I really wanted to do this. Is something I've wanted to do on the channel for a long time, and I've committed to doing it. But uh, I'm going to come to you guys with my hat in my hand, if you will, and ask if you would contribute to it. As you can see, we're on the Ted Weber website here. And this is an amplifier kit called the Smokin' Joe 2. It's an amplifier I've never heard before. It's a push-pull um, 6BQ5 EL84 type circuit. And it just seemed really interesting to me. I've looked at it about two dozen times, and it's a single 10-inch speaker. And with 15 watts behind a single 10-inch speaker, it's probably loud as crap. It has a single volume, single tone, and a master volume, so you can basically overdrive the, the uh, heck out of it. Um, and my intent is to get this kit in and build it piece by piece by piece, all on the channel in real time. So we're going to have hours of video coming up of this, and it's going to be really exciting stuff. But if you've ever done a Ted Weber kit before, uh, maybe you'll realize... Uh, Okay, they have, if you ever read any of this uh, stuff, you know, thank you for your interest in building an amp. We want to let you know these amps are not Lego kits. You are going to essentially get, you can download a schematic and a layout, val uh, layout uh, diagram, and you're on your own. You know, no warranties, no nothing. And there's been people online on YouTube or whatever that, you know, show this is the amp I built, check it out, isn't it cool? And I'm admittedly one of those. Um, the Arena Verb is based on the Revibe, and the um, Braddock amp that I have is based on the Lauren amp there. There were a couple of little mods in there, but nothing too major. But I'm going to build this pretty much all stock. The only thing I'm going to not order as part of this kit is uh, the tubes. I'm going to get tubes that I think are a little more robust. Um, and I'm going to supply a little bit of extra wire. That's about it. So I'm going to do this, you know, exactly as you would do this. So if any of you ever have had ambitions to build one of these things and you want to order the kit um, and do it yourself or do it along with me, uh, there it is on the site. And uh, this is the price including a speaker and everything else if you wanted to. Um, you know, build a head version out of it or whatever you can. The construction will be the same, and you're gonna you'd be able to save probably about a hundred bucks by not getting a uh, cabinet that has a speaker. But this should be a, a real fun project. Let's click on the layout here. Um, so yeah, we essentially have what uh, is going to be a single eyelet board here. Our components are here, and they're actually, this is going to be raised above the tubes, which are going to be, although they're shown over here, they don't actually go there. They're going to be um, more like this little diagram in the corner. They're going to be stacked on top of each other in a square pattern underneath there. So, again, these kits come with no instructions, and there's, the first time you do one of these, you're kind of going to be staring at the wall going, what the heck, but... We want to encourage you guys to, uh, you know, get out there and, and do something like this. You know, don't be afraid to shock yourself. So, uh, I've had a lot of people just jazzed about building those little AliExpress pedals and asking me questions and stuff like that. And I know there was some frustration when my camera battery goes dead and we missed the last five minutes of the AliExpress pedal build. So, I'm going to try to work on this and maybe do a half an hour video each time and work on this over a course of a couple of days. Um, and get this amp all built. This is not a complex build. It's not as simple, easy as a Fender Champ per se, but it's not a lot harder. And this amp is a curiosity of me because it's not one that uh, I've seen anyone else ever build or play online or anything else. So this is completely new to me and I'm going to build it based on uh, their recommendations and all this kind of stuff and you know when I'm done I'll put my name on it because I'll be proud of it so if you want to join in this video series that's great you can get your own kit you can just stare and watch along um, I am going to put this up on YouTube as you know this channel is not monetized but uh, with my hat in my hand I have thrown a link underneath 
for uh, PayPal if you'd like to help out with this project. But this project will be coming probably in the next month. So next month, starting January, we're going to build an amp from complete scratch. And what I'm liking here, if we look up here, essentially you have a single input, you have a volume, which is also your on-off, and you have a tone pot, and you have a master volume. So you can essentially crank this, which is your gain, crank that up, turn the master volume down, and get a little roaring box that should be small enough that you can carry it around. So I'm jazzed, I hope you're jazzed, and uh, you can join me in this quest next month. There might be some other repair videos between there, but uh, yeah, here I am with my hat in my hand. Help me out, brothers. All right, peace. Thanks for watching.